guys, it's Noir with another video, and this right here is this week's edition of Superstar Spotlights. And as you've seen, I'm doing it on NXT's resident enchanted raven haired lady page. Um, so let's get started. Um, name page, her birth name is Saria J. Bevis, uh, date of birth August 17, 1992. Uh, she's 20 years old and she's from Norwich, England. Um, this chick's only two years older than me. <laughs> uh, height, uh, five foot eight, same height as me. <laughs> weight, one hundred twenty pounds. Obviously, uh, obviously weigh a whole lot more than her. Uh, she's been trained by Saria Knight, her mother, uh, Ricky Knight, uh, Zach Zodiac, and the WAW Academy and Klondike Kate. So, uh, her debut. She made her pro wrestling debut in two thousand six. Uh, she's wrestled in various promotions uh, such as WA. W, uh, Pro Wrestling Eve, Shimmer, Shimmer's Wrestling Athletes, um, and now WWE, NXT, slash FCW. Um, in April 2011, uh, Bevis got a tryout when he was in England. Um, in September 2011, she signed a WWE, slash NXT, slash FCW contract. On uh, January 5th, 2012, she made a debut at a live house show, uh, as Soraya, uh, as Paige, she debuted, uh, wait a minute, yeah, as Paige, she debuted on FCW NXT TV, um, in the backstage segment showing Seth Rollins, uh, some kind of information on the, on a laptop, um, but then later on that night, she would make an appearance attacking Summer Rae, helping Seth Rollins win his match, um, and in March 2012, uh, Paige, she formed an alliance with both Rick Victor and Sofia Cortez. Um, Sofia Cortez and hers alliance was called the Anti Diva Army. Uh, in March 19th, um, Paige and Cortez lost their first match, and both their ring debut, uh, both of their ring debuts, um, to Audrey Marie and Caitlin. Um, and Paige and I already mentioned that earlier. Paige and Cortez formed an alliance with Rick Victor. Um, May 6th, um, Paige defeated Raquel Diaz in a non title match um, that also included Audrey Marie. Uh, May 27th, Paige got her title shot but lost to Raquel Diaz when she um, <laughs> pretty much stole uh, some of her daddy's moves, lied, cheating, and stealing. Um, but yeah, she lost a match via disqualification. Um, on June 10th, uh, Paige defeated Audrey Marie. I mean, Audrey Marie defeated Paige when Sofia Cortez, uh, interfered on, uh, Marie's behalf, you know, thus, you know, ending their partnership. Um, July 1st, uh, Audrey Marie defeated Paige via disqualification when Paige kept on beating her down. Um, and on the final episode, which is July 25th. Of FCW, Audrey Marie defeated Paige in a nose qualification match to end the feud there in FCW. Uh, Paige defeated, debuted, excuse me, on NXT in July 2012, where she lost to both uh, Sofia Cortez and Raquel Diaz, respectively, on respect, respected uh, matches. Um, and on September 5th, she defeated Audrey Marie. In her first uh, singles win on NXT. And on September 19th, she defeated Alicia Fox um, in a singles competition, which was her biggest win yet um, so far. And on October 10th, um, Paige and Audrey Marie both de they defeated the team of Alicia Fox and Caitlyn. And on October 24th, she and Audrey Marie lost to Alicia Fox, where Layla pinned uh, Audrey Marie. Uh, Paige is one of the most respective, respected and um, popular divas on the NXT roster. Uh, I mean, when this girl's music hits, um, the guys and the girls, they eat it up in the NXT arena and at the live shows. Um, so, yeah. And I heard a rumor earlier tonight that WWE is looking to put um, some, main, some developmental divas on the main roster. So I hope, you know, this rumor is true, and I hope we can see Paige as soon as, you know, after Survivor Series. So, yeah, that'd be pretty cool. Um, her finisher is Rampage, the cradle DDT. That's so sick, especially the way Audrey Marie sells it. 
uh, nickname, like I said earlier, is the Enchanted um, Raven Hair Lady and uh, Hell in Boots by Wim Regal. He both he calls her by both of those nicknames. Um, and her theme song is Smash in the Face by Jim Johnston. Um, like I said, I like Paige a whole lot. And her future in the WWE and NXT is, is very, very evident. It's going to be great. She's young. Um, and she's got a mo she's got a lot of experience, like Sean says. Um, and it shows, it shows, because, like I said, the crowd loves her, you know, and you know, they re they just eat it up. Her and Biggie Langston, everything they throw out, they eat it up. So yeah, um, this is Laura J. Well, uh, another edition of Superstar Spotlights. Uh, next week, I think I'll be doing one on Biggie Langston. Um, if you guys want me to do any early requests, I'll do that. But uh, until then, I'll do uh, Biggie Langston next week. So this is Larger with another video, and peace.